Productivity and efficiency both measure the ratio of outputs per unit of inputs. Outputs are the things or services produced and delivered. Inputs are the costs, materials, energy, labour, etc. Better productivity and efficiency would mean getting either more units of output per unit of input or the same output for less input. We might typically say productivity when referring to a productive resource such as human labour or a machine's time, whereas we might say efficiency when referring to a resource that is consumed, such as materials or energy, but they are still both just measures of units of output per unit of input. Some examples might be things delivered per driver hour, or number of good biscuits made per kilogram of ingredients. Productivity and efficiency are important to measure performance, but careful with the details. What is it that we're measuring the productivity or efficiency of? We need to give ourselves a clear definition. What are the specific units of input and output? And are these really the outputs that we want to maximise? Productivity and efficiency are good things, and keeping this ratio under review is important, but only as a supporting metric, not as the primary purpose. Productive or efficient is not the same as busy. Efficiently producing stuff that isn't needed is not efficient. If a toy factory decides to double the quantity produced in a batch to maximise utilisation and improve productivity when there are no extra customers to buy the extra products, that could appear efficient on the metrics but probably does not create extra revenue and will incur more costs storing the products in the hope of selling them one day. So, productivity and efficiency, ratios of output over inputs, important to track but not the purpose of the supply chain or operations.